Hello guys and welcome to Walking Project. Let's say you always wanted a 7 inch in your pocket but it never grew that much. Now is the time to compensate for that and get yourself a brand new shiny 7 inch phone. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my full comparison of the Honor 8X Max versus the Xiaomi Mi Max 3. Which one is better? Let's find out. Okay guys, so why exactly both of those phones you might say? Well, simply because for 200 quid you don't have many options when it comes down to 7 inch monsters guys. What's interesting in this comparison is that Honor derailed uh, <laughs> of their Kirin chipset and went for the Snapdragon 636 the same as OC found in the Xiaomi Mi Max 3. Now, if you want a in depth speed comparison between both of those phones, I have already done a speed test to see which one is better. Quick hint, this one is better. But anyway, I'm gonna leave a link in the description down below, as well as I did a comprehensive camera test between both of those phones. Another hint, this one is better again. But anyway, today I'm gonna follow my new vlogging project spectrum system where the phones are going to fall somewhere in the spectrum between 0 and 50 depending on how good they are and I'm going to do that by giving them scores from 0 to 5 in 10 different categories. So starting with the first category is design and build quality. Now the Honor 8X actually have a plastic back. I found that out after the third day of usage because it looks like glass so much and it's so nicely done that it's absolutely amazing guys. It reflects, retracts light, this and that. I mean it's simply amazing. The sides are made of aluminum and they're blue as well. And the front is pretty nice, a small teardrop notch over here, Honor logo, a small chin. I really love the design of this one, so it easily gets 5 out of 5, guys. On the other hand, the Xiaomi is really, really premium feeling. It has some sort of a very nice, subtle kind of satin finish on the metal back over here. I've already dropped this phone twice on my floor, wooden floor at home and there's absolutely no scratch or no mark on it so definitely very very sturdy phone no notch small bezels so again on the Xiaomi Mi Max 3 gets 5 out of 5 as well and actually it comes down to your personal preference what you like more shiny or a little bit more subtle so the next category is security and by security I mean fingerprint readers whatever type there is and face unlock as well so both of those phones have um, a little bit higher mounted fingerprint readers over here. Both of them are one of the best in the business and both of them has face unlock as well. So in this particular case, I'm gonna give five out of five to both phones, well deserved. The next category is battery life, which includes charging time as well. The Xiaomi Mi Max 3 charges a little bit over two hours and the Honor 8X Max charges for just under two hours, but it has a little bit smaller battery, so pretty much equal. Now, when it comes down to battery life, the Honor, I'm getting between seven and nine hours of screen on time, guys. So I can't really give it more than four out of five. Uh, and the thing is that this phone lacks Band 20 and Band 7 LTE here in Europe and especially in the UK, this is crucial. So basically you're getting 4G like only 30% of the time or depending on your network. But even if you use it in Wi-Fi only, you can't really get more than 9 hours anyway. So between 7 and 9 hours, 4 out of 5. On the Xiaomi Mi Max 3 over here, easily every single time you're getting between 9 and 11 or even 12 hours of screen on time guys. Excellent result and I can give it 5 out of 5 hands down. So the next category is screens. Both of those screens are really nice, well saturated but both of them lack in one particular department and this is the black levels. They literally glow guys. I mean the IPS glow is immense on both screens Otherwise, I'm happy with the contrast in, and the saturation as well. But because both of them are LCD screens and just 1080p is a little bit of a stretch at 7 inches, so both phones get 3 out of 5. And then the next category is speakers. In case of the Honor 8X Max, we've got dual speaker setup over here. One speaker over here and one speaker over here. The stereo separation is real, it's 50-50 and these are one of the best speakers I have ever heard in my life. So easily 
five out of five over here guys on the show me the situation is a little bit different actually you've got one proper speaker and they have activated the small speaker over here on top so the separation is kind of like 90 percent from the bottom and only 10 percent from the top over here it's loud enough but the quality is not that good actually so i can't really give it more than four out of five and i'm being generous over here right so the next category is headphone jack or headphone output if you may say i'm happy to report that both of those phones this one has a headphone jack at the bottom this one at the top over here and they sound really really amazing i'm gonna give five out of five for the honor atx max over here but Keep in mind that the Xiaomi is just a little bit louder, guys. Just a little bit louder. One of the loudest available at the market right now. So headphone output, you're going to be plenty happy with each one of those phones. And the next category is software, which is basically the skin. We've got EMUI and MIUI in both cases. I love both. Plenty of customizations. Really nice and fluid team support, basically everything you might ever wish. So both phones are getting 5 out of 5. Okay, so we're coming down to performance now, which includes gaming as well. And unfortunately, on the Honor 8X Max, I'm really not happy of the job done over here. Snapdragon 636 performs noticeably better on the Xiaomi. So in terms of gaming performance, is better as well. So I'm giving the Xiaomi 4 out of 5. And unfortunately, I have to give the 8x max 3 out of 5 because the gaming performance is choppy at times and the gestures well they lack a little bit but they lack over here as well so yeah the xiaomi gets 4 out of 5 and the honor 3 out of 5 guys okay so the last thing to talk about is cameras as i already said i've done a comprehensive camera test between both of those phones but let me break it down to you really quickly both of the front facing cameras suck on those phones so i'm gonna give them two out of five you've got no 4k recording no proper stabilization and they're pretty much average and very simple camera applications so yeah unfortunately two out of five i don't like these cameras now when it comes down to the rear cameras the situation is just a little bit better for the xiaomi for the honor it is not i'm gonna give it two out of five simply because you've got no stabilization whatsoever no 4k recording as well the HDR is overly aggressive, the AI is doing some weird things with the photos and the nighttime pictures are really terrible. So 2 out of 5, I'm being 100% honest over here. And for the Xiaomi, I almost gave it 4 out of 5, but I'm going to give it 3 out of 5, guys, because you've got no stabilization at 4K. Uh, the camera application is very restricted. The bouquet is not very good, but otherwise... In daytime good light this camera is actually quite capable guys but honestly I can't give it more than three out of five okay guys so it's conclusion time where do these phones fall on the vlogging spectrum score well the Honor 8x Max gets 39 out of 50 and the Xiaomi Mi Max 3 gets 41 out of 50 as well so if you look at the scores the Xiaomi is the better phone and in reality Ah, well, they're pretty, pretty, pretty close, guys. Pretty much in most categories, the Xiaomi is just a little bit better than the Honor. But to be honest with you, my personal preference when it comes down to design and overall build is the Honor simply because of the plastic back. You can't really dent it, you can't scratch it, you can easily replace it if needed. And uh, I kind of like the teardrop design over here of the notch. You've got full screen display, so the display is a little bit bigger. So basically when it comes down to design, my personal preference is the look of the Honor over here, guys. But everything else, the performance is a little bit better over here, the headphone output is a little bit better, the cameras are a little bit better. But on the other hand, when it comes down to stereo speakers, this phone is better, guys. So overall, if you want to use one of those phones just as a tablet, I would say that as a multimedia machine, the 8x max is just a little bit better simply because the screen is a little bit bigger and the speakers sound better guys but that's only if you're planning to you know watch netflix youtube my videos of course but if you're too much into gaming and you know you like to take shots every now and then i would go for the 
Mi Max 3 over here guys because overall is the better phone and the battery life is better so it really both phones are really good but let's let, let's put it this way if screen and sound are more important to you and looks go for this one if the battery life the overall performance and the camera are more important to you go for the Xiaomi but no matter which phone you actually pick both of those are really 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 good phones for 200 pounds guys and something else is well, as well if you decide to go for the ATX Max there's another version with Snapdragon 660 now I haven't really tried it I'm not sure how better it's gonna be but of course it's gonna be better than the 636 maybe shell another I think the 30 or 40 quid and get the Snapdragon 660 version it should be a little bit better or at least on the level of the Mi Max 3 over here but if your budget is strictly, you know, 200 pounds, go for the Mi Max 3. So yeah, that's about it, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I've got plenty of videos on both of those phones. I've got the reviews as well. I'm going to link everything in the description down below. Make sure you check it out. Thank you very much for watching. This was Tony from Vlogging Project. Adios.